All right, welcome back, everybody. Um, last time, before time before we built our power plant, and this time we got started. I knew I was go on. We've got our little area sorted here. Um, I made a change since last time. I'm not sure why I didn't figure this out before. I actually stuck the logistical sorter right on the chest. I don't need a stupid hopper. That is much faster than, if you notice, much, much faster than the hopper. So, today, I was having to think about how to manage this. I don't want to just use one color or one type of wood because we're getting kind of an even amount of everything. I don't want to drain one over the other. So I need purple and then the next two after that. That's all I need to remember. Okay. So. my energy smelter. Good. Basically, to do what I want to do today, and get rid of our water, we need to come down to this level and make a small change to the way this works. Okay. Okay. Um, I was hoping to have a little more room than that, but that's okay. Basically, What are we on here? I don't know why I have to push two different buttons, but I have to. Okay. So this one here. Dark red. Purple. And then fill that back in and that in. Uh, okay. Connect that there. Indigo. So what that does is we've got those three set up there. It will send it down to each of these on a round robin. So it'll go one to the bin, one down the pipe, one to the bin, one down the pipe. And they'll all meet up basically here because that pipe is the actual red one. That's my plan. And it looks like actually I need to go this way. So I want to go under the. Where's my sleeping bag? There we go. Let's make it daytime. I really do try to sleep during the times, uh, sleep through the night on times that uh, 
I'm actually not building in time lapse mode. Okay. That should take care of that. We're just going to throw a torch in there. I don't need stone brick to cover that up again. Now to go inside. Okay, that's where that comes up. Okay, um, so I did mention I need power to start. But once I have power, it's not going to be a big deal. Okay, move, 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 move. I said move. Just die, okay? Simpler solution. Okay, so to start off, we're going to put our energized smelter right there. Then we're going to take our basic universal cable and I need to figure out how I want to do that. Yeah, that's close enough to a corner. I can do that here. Stick that there. Okay. Take our four. Steam dynamos. Again, this is all just temporary. And we'll pull that out. Power. Okay. Oi. Okay, um. Best way to do the next step. We're going to need some logistical transporters. If we come out the side, output, auto reject on, and then we come up. And that gets to those two. Do some mechanical piping. This is very messy. Normally, the setup I'm going for here has a much better setup, but I think I'm going to switch to it. I was hoping to do it up, but up doesn't seem to be the best method. Seems my buddy had it right. I did not mean to pick up that machine. Also need to make the input on the bottom. Okay. So take our universal cable. Take our power creators like so. Our logistical transporter like 
like so. And he needs to get down. Yeah, we'll just go this way. Like that. We will put our How interesting. I did not manage to bring a bucket. Yes, I did. I got a bucket. Okay. So our bucket goes right there. And I don't like how this has to be powered, but deal with it. Off. Off. Break that. Okay. Uh, that is not the best placement for that, actually. Um... Let's go down one. That's what we'll do. We'll just go down one more. I said one, not two. Okay. Stick that there. Break that. Uh, mechanical pipe. Nothing. Actually, that one I did want to push normally. Mechanical pipe. Over. Okay, then we just need power. Take our universal cable. There we go. Now it will power the pump. And the pump will feed water and the items will go in there. And look, we've already got some stuff to burn. So to kickstart it, we need water is what we need. Let's go grab two buckets of water. See that turned on. There we go. We've got two running. That should be a hundred and sixty. Each of those produce 80. Let's see, he's actually backfilling. He'll start backfilling in a minute. We've just kick-started our system. There is the start of our power plant. <laughs> Like I said, this is only temporary, getting the items to here. Eventually they'll be processed elsewhere, and they'll just, whatever raw resources we need in this room will be here. But we needed power. And we've got it. We've got a mild amount of power. And 
And once these get full, so he's actually turned off at the minute. We're going to need some energy upgrades and some speed upgrades. So let's go work on that part now. Right after I sleep. Take my path. We some energy and some speed. Can we afford eight of each? Items. Speed upgrade, two of those, and so eight osmium dust. Eight, we need 16 of those. Thirteen. The other part was just glass, right? Yep. And then item energy upgrades. Draw these things. We need gold dust and another 16. Eight and 16. than I thought they were going to be. Okay, let's go install that. And then we'll get this really cooking. Now I went this route with the steam because um, to start off it produces more power. There are, apparently, and I did not know this, reactors in me mechanism. So that'll be fun. You turned off. Put in the energy upgrades. speed upgrades. It says you've stopped, but why? You stopped receiving? check out our tree farm and see what's going on there. I almost think it's because we went out of range. I might need to put a dimensional anchor here. Loaded, but I think I went out of range. Actually, did I break my anchor? I did, because I don't think I built around it.
Okay. Six, seven, eight. Well, let's make two of them. Eighteen and eight. I'm going to stick one up here. Just a huge radius. But I want to make sure it's huge enough. I'm going to hide the other one inside this building here. Okay. Now why is that not getting... I was sure there was a way you could do that. Well, I'll have to play with that, but that's the basic idea. Is that we're going to be sending processed goods down here. Input, output. speed and energy anyway I will play with that but we have started to use our power plant I will in the next one of the next episodes we're gonna set up uh, I can't remember what it's called but it's basically a big power um, storage unit for mechanism and then right at the top is how I want to get the power out of here I want to put it up there and then like a power line that goes places. So thanks for watching everybody. I hope you've enjoyed. Please like it if you liked it and enjoyed the video. And uh, as always, until next time, have fun.